All right, Alice, as we wait for Sue Haas from India to come in, mate, the Seagulls started their campaign again after a bit of a hiccup last week. Valley's no games because of COVID. Um, up against the Bulldogs, the Dish Lickers. Um, you were at uh, Racehall. We'll come back to that. But first grade, obviously, what happened there? They won the toss, did they? Or did they get sent in? No, they lost the toss, got put into bowl. And, um, yeah, they're five. We have them five for 130. Got well, put into bowl. I like that. Five for 130. Yeah. Uh, Benji Flores getting three for... He's... Um, I don't think I've seen a bowler in Premier Grade cricket for some time who can actually bowl that lethal Yorker. I haven't seen it for long. We see Scotty Walter gets a lot of away movement. He gets a lot of edges, whereas Benji Flores just seems to pitch him up. I'm not sure how he got those wickets today, but I wouldn't be surprised if they were either LBW or bowled or, or caught by, uh, by, by a keeper. Yeah, like that's something that we've definitely been working on is making sure that, you know, we've been a, be a bit fuller. I think... Um, Earlier on in the year, we were too straight and we were um, too short. So that's definitely something that we have been working on, making sure that we pitch the ball up, give it an opportunity, opportunity to swing, uh, especially at the start of innings. And we know at Wynnum, there's always something in the wicket and there's always a good carry and pace. So, um, yeah, it's good to see he's still bowling well. Um, off Finishing off before Christmas, he was, he was coming along nicely. Mm. So... Um, and then you say Scott Walter. Well, he took, I think, today was his 28th by in first grade. <laughs> Ridiculous. But anyway, yeah. and, and the uh, lot, which is something you'll probably suffer from before too long, that, and he's still got a hell of a dad bod, but he still gets fifers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's, um, he's just showing that um, he's, he's got a lot of skill, that's for sure. And um, age is no barrier, that's for sure. Um, so credit to him, he's... Um, He's been doing an amazing job for a long period of time. Second grade, uh, do you want to move on from it or do you want to mention it briefly? It was it was a real green... Um, look, we, we, can, we, can cut, we can cover it in about 30 seconds. Go for it. If that. <laughs> yeah, got gotcha. uh, All out well, for 98. Yeah. All out for 98. Won the toss. Won the toss and thought, no, nah, it'll be a good day to bat. And um, then at lunch, we'll five down after... For all fight, we had just a lot of poor cricket shots today. That's for sure. It was, yeah, just very disappointing. Andrew now batted very well. Uh, unfortunately, he got 47, but he was batting with uh, 10 and Jack. So um, there's a lot of there was pressure on him. So he, he did his part that he, he could. Unfortunately, just no one stuck with him. So, and then the rain came, and we'll um, move on to next week where, you know, we've got a very good bowling attack. So I reckon we've definitely had a chance if we turn up with the right attitude and bowl. Um, with purpose, next week we definitely can win. Well, you posted the total, so that's uh, always a start. Uh, lower grades, mate, yeah. it's a bit Mitch and match there, but uh, sixth grade, probably the, the, the standout, Dale Hanson again, uh, 47 not out at the moment, I think. Uh, a couple of other scores, a couple of yep. your head. Um, yeah, a couple of young blokes, we've got sort of getting some, some starts. Um, and then uh, I know third grade, they're three for 50 uh, off about 32 overs. Um, Bowling. So, speaking to Brett, saying that you know the week was really nice and they bowled really well. Um, West probably didn't have that as much intent with their batting. Yeah. So, you know, a good start for the boys in freeze. So, next week we'll, um, I guess, yeah, it'll be interesting to see how those lower grade go guys go. Just also with the rain around, um, so they'll probably get about eighty overs in or so next week. Okay. And um, yeah, obviously, hopefully we can still force a force a result in the lower grades. Do you, uh, you have an early start next week then to make up for the lost time? 9.30 till 5.30. Can't wait, eh? Sorry? So it's a long day.